I couldn't be any more proud. It was an open-ended offer. Zach said, all right, let's go. If you want to talk about Zach Parrish, please step up. His wife, Gracie, asked for stories. So I want to hear about him, and I want to soak it in. That was their four-year-old saying, just be happy. And so the happy stories just kept coming. I remember in roll call and be like, all right, what are you doing, Parrish? Ooh Someone's going to jail tonight. <laughs> we learned that the 29-year-old never stopped. Zach didn't have an off switch. Not on the 10th hour of a shift. He was still going after it. And not on the day he walked into an apartment trying to help someone and got shot and killed instead. He didn't flinch. He didn't back down. He didn't hesitate because he went to the call to help someone who killed him. He went there to help that guy. He didn't go there to hurt the guy. He didn't go there to beat him up. He didn't go there to throw him out the window. He went there to help this guy. We learned he was a deputy with a calling, but his first calling was always this one. And I will raise these girls to love you. Gracie, he loved you and your daughter so much. So these men and women will step up not just tonight. And you guys are not alone. But for Gracie and the girls the rest of their lives. He was our brother. And you are now our sister. And for, here and forever. Because they need to keep going for Zach. I know that we're all looking for a model officer. And that's Zach Parrish. I take a hundred of them.